Hey guys, what's going on? Been a while since my last video, but uh, we are out here in the middle of Mexico. Um, got the GoPro on the car right here. And what we're doing today, let's get out of the sun. What we're doing today is hopefully not getting pulled over, first of all. Second of all, we are going to do some zero to 60 videos because I'm curious what my car runs zero to 60. I'm sure other people are curious because why not? So basically we have the, I'll explain some of the mods on the car first of all. So it's, E30 tuned by PD tuning, um, catless downpipe, stock intake with a drop-in filter, step cooler, NGK spark plugs, um, no wastegate actuator yet, not installed. Um, let's see, what else do I have? Huh. It's basically it, I believe. Um, but it's got a drag radial, uh, like I said, the Mickey Thompson ET Street SS drag radial. Um, and we are going to see what the car runs, zero to 60 according to the track apps. Now, let me remind you that the tire I have on the car right here is a 27.7 inch diameter tire, which means that it's, I believe, 0.7 inches bigger than the stock tire. So the track app's probably gonna be slightly off. Now I will let you know that I've hit in the four second, not four second flat, but I've hit in the fours before on the track apps. Um, but that was spinning on my other tire. So I'm curious what I can do on the drag radials hooking on a decent street. So basically I'm just going to record me accelerating um, up to 60 in the car. I have the GoPro on the car recording kind of like the tire area to see uh, what's going on there. So without further ado, let's get to it. All right, so we're gonna turn traction control all the way off by holding it. Don't mind the tire pressure sensors because I don't have any uh, sensors in my drag radials. And basically, I'm going to leave it in drive. Not doing a burnout, none of that. I'm going to leave it in drive. Windows down. Um, basically, just brake boost it, see what we can do to 60. Now, I'm going to go to track apps right here. It's not accelerometer, acceleration timer, 0 to 60, automatic start. Basically, it's going to start whenever I start moving. So I'm going to do my best to get a good video of this. Okay, so that first run I forgot to turn my GoPro on for. So we are turning the GoPro on now. So I can get the rear shot. Got to make sure everything's off, traction control's off. And... Let's uh, let's do this one more All time. Right, we're gonna try this. See what uh, what happens. All right, four point seven seconds. Not bad. So basically, with a soft launch, because I'm kind of a little bit uh, weary of the street right now because I spun out so bad on the first one, but um, 4.7 seconds with a very soft launch. I can definitely uh, launch harder if I drop the air pressure. I'm going to see if I can find another street around here. You know, the streets of Mexico are kind of, uh, they're, 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 they're kind of busy. Um, but this is definitely the best area to be doing this right now. So I'm just gonna try to find another street um, to see if I can get a good launch in real quick. See if we can get any better than 4.7. I think we can. That is the street I wanna be on right there. So I'm gonna flip around, um, go set up, launch again, see if I can get something like 4.5, maybe a little bit faster. I might drop the air pressure too, who knows? Point seven and 4.8 is the uh, it's the uh, two runs I got today um, earlier I got one that was like 4.9 but I was spinning so I don't really want to count it but um, that's that's probably gonna be the best I'm gonna do on these roads because 
we don't have the best roads around here. I mean, we do, just not, we close the windows, just not where I am right now, unfortunately. Um, and I have pulled like low four second on the track, but that's the track, it's prepped. I can't really replicate that on a road in Mexico. So, if you're curious about, you know, what your EcoBoost does zero to 60 with similar mods to what mine has, and remember I have a drag radial. It should be somewhere in mid four second range, uh, maybe a little bit slower, four seven, four eight. Um, and mind you, that my tire size is bigger than a stock tire, so it's probably slightly slower than it should be. It would probably, with a stock tire size, be read out as a four six or a four five, possibly. I don't know how 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 off it is, but to to be accurate, I would need to get an actual. Um, they they actually make zero to sixty cal or not calculators. They make like zero to sixty timers that are GPS based and not based off the computer, tire size, etc. But just wanna make that quick video to give you kinda of like a baseline on what the EcoBoost can run zero to 60, what mine runs zero to 60 if anyone was interested. But anyways guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it was informational, hope it helped you guys out. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and have a great day.